Last time. It has been some time. Last Not time. Not visibly, because it, uh, the updates haven't really slowed down that much, but, uh... Not too much. It has been about a month, month and a half, since we actually recorded <laughs> any of this game. So... It's busy. Except not really. Oh, but, uh... Really. So anyway, we've got a few things to take care of here. But first, time to go to the House of Sculptula. Also, for the our fans great off. Yeah, we turned off the fan God because... Goddamn people. <laughs> apparently it was worse than Satan. God, like... I, I could have, like, probably gotten less shit over killing people's children. <laughs> really? Yes. I could have killed a child and gotten less shit over it. <laughs> I don't think that's true. Well, that's what I felt Gotta like. Gotta get the Stone of Agony. It'll help. It will help. <clears throat> oh, look, it looks like a little pack. Except it doesn't work. Go away. I'm never coming back here again. Did you get the wallet? Yeah, I did. Okay. I missed that. So, our goal <clears throat> today is... Ice cavern, basically, Ice which is pretty cavern. much unnecessary, but it's necessary. Yeah, yeah, this weird room. I like these weird graphic things going on in here that you don't really see. Come on now. <coughs> what the hell was that like? It's okay. They're, <coughs> they're like zombies, unless they're the fast zombie kind. <laughs> Uh, I like how the Redeads kind of, like, mourn the dead. Like, if you kill one, they all kind of walk over to it. It's kinda creepy. Da, da. Well, got enough money for the blue fire now. So that's a subtle hint if anybody wants to, like, get money there. So, anyway, um... I totally had that in mind. <laughs> I don't remember if we showed it off, um, but they're... Is it these guys? Yeah, let yeah. me actually show the dialogue, um, just for people who are interested. Uh... Mm -hmm. Thank Throw you. the bush Thank at you it. for picking up the bush. I want to try my hand at selling blue fire. How was I supposed to know? It's been harvested completely. Now only collectors in town have blue fire anymore, and, I, and you need to have a bigger wallet to even buy any of it. Yes. So, yeah, so basically, much tell um, you straight out what you need to do. You need blue fire to thaw King Zora in well, order to. Uh, yeah, there's a really weird glitch, glitch you can do, but. Uh, Normal game. Anyway, play. yeah, you need the fire to thaw him, and there's none actually in the ice cavern, so you have to get the wallet by getting 30 sculptulas and then buy it from here. Yeah. So I made um, the, the the wallet actually, like, necessary, basically. So if you get to this point and don't have 30 sculptulas yet, which and, is very easy to not have that many yeah. because you kind of have to go out of your way in a lot of places, <clears throat> then this part of the game kind of turns into a fetch quest. Maybe. Um, but you can get through the water temple without it. It's just helpful yeah. to have. I do say in the readme to try not to ignore the sculptures too yeah. much. Let me so. uh, go ahead and take this but off nobody the so I don't accidentally use so. it. But yeah, like, I always think <coughs> it's interesting, because, like, in, in you never use the wallet. Like, you always get the crap free wherever you go. So I wanted to be able to force people to, to buy something to actually use the amount of money that you find. Yeah, it's like, seriously, the only thing and you ever... Like, the only thing you ever buy in a normal playthrough of Ocarina of Time is shield. the shield at the very beginning and maybe the magic beans if you yeah. want to go for that. And you don't even have to do those. Um, but yeah, it's... And, like, seriously, whoever buys blue fire anyway, you know? Or seems... a fish. Yeah, or a fish, so. Or a fairy. Or the. Po like, there's. They've got all these potions in this game, but you will never freaking use yeah, them exactly. because. Fairies. Like, fairies are. They're OP. <laughs> fairies are a lot better than potions. You can get them for free. Um, there's green potion, but running out of magic isn't usually that big of a deal. I actually did use it in testing. I actually used green potions in testing, so, yeah. Because I used a lot of magic testing stuff. So. Is there a way to reach the... Uh, okay. You need a chicken. Hey. Hey. Ever. I don't know if you can actually hookshot this. No, not the... Not the the hugs anyway. Oh well. You'd have to go up there. Not gonna bother then. That heart will just... I always get hit by that thing. Whenever you go up there. Suddenly and yeah, as, as people hard. pointed out, uh, you can totally <clears throat> use the boomerang to get that thing when yeah. you're a kid. I you forgot disturbed. about that. Yeah. I forgot that I had the boomerang because you yeah. usually don't, don't your really first time it. through this place, mm -hmm. so... I do like this area, though. I just wish there was more to do. Yeah. 
I like, I hit the second weird. sequence of buttons there, and none of them registered <laughs> at all. It's a little slow on the, on the uptake. So anyway, time Squish to head link. into the best area of the game. I like that cutscene. It makes Link squish into a kid. Yes. <clears throat> I used to think he was, like, oh God, I forgot about this. I, I, <laughs> I love it so much, though. This is just hilarious to me. <laughs> I all got frozen. <laughs> so were they just riding down the waterfall okay, and then it flash okay, froze? This or? is what happened. I know. I, I know what happened, but go ahead and explain This is it. what happened. I wanted them to be under the ice, like in uh, like in TP, where you, you look down and you see their frozen, agonized faces. The problem is... When you put them under the ice, they don't function. So, you like you. No, can, the problem was you could still talk. You to could them. still talk to them, like, and it was so stupid being able to like go up to them and talk to them while they're supposed to be frozen and agonized, you know. And it was just like, okay, I have to figure out how to get these frozen Zoras in here. So I just stuck them on the waterfall because. I think you can actually manage to talk to one if you fiddle about a bit, but you can't really talk to them as bad on there, and it just, it's a hilarious image, and I had to keep it after I put them on there, because, oh my god. <laughs> it was kind of amazing. Yeah. I thought that was so funny when I put them, because I knew when I put them on there that it looked really stupid, and I just had to keep it because of it. Hey, you gotta talk to me. <clears throat> Bro. Uh, try, uh, Z-targeting. I'm trying. There we go. Oh, I've come back to life. It was mighty cold. Don't be nervous. Looking at you, I'm thinking. What does the don't be nervous have to do with anything? I don't know, because he's a fish. He's a gigantic fish. I grant you this tunic. <clears throat> Zort tunic. It's totally blue. It's totally blue. It's totally blue. Hey! Okay, it might not be blue. I can't change that. <laughs> I know. But yeah, this is the best tunic in the game. Yes. It's purple. Yes. I actually had a pull. Um, we to, were originally going to gonna go with uh, the light a blue. A light blue, and it didn't look right. It, it looked weird. Over here. So, no. I heard one scritch scratching about. I think if you look down, you can see Azora staring at you. Yeah. <laughs> they're still totally alive. Yeah, yeah they're it's totally just... alive. They're just frozen in the water, and they can't move. But yeah, I really wanted to make that TP thing. It just didn't work. I just, I was so upset by that. So, so I'll just stick him in the waterfall. waterfall. It'll be fine. Well, I wanted some kind of Zora life. Well, Zora frozen life, anyway. So, anyway, um, we already have the iron boots, because you got those quite a while ago. Um, we just got the Zora tunic. So, what is the purpose of going through the ice cavern, you may ask? Um, well, not there to get is... the serenade of water. <laughs> yeah, not to get the serenade of water, that's for sure. Because this um, game likes to fuck you but, over. But, <laughs> uh, there is an item in here, which is not necessary but helpful and with that description alone you can probably guess what it is but let's uh go through it it's not a terribly yeah. long dungeon yeah. i think you should be able to climb under one of these no maybe not that one actually while i'm thinking about it hmm. <clears throat> no oh yeah unless you moved it uh, probably not god this game seems dark Oh, because it's nighttime. <laughs> that, and we have a really bright background. That, too. Link is staring at us from the background. Twice. Twice, yeah. I like this underwater area, though. I remember actually hey. discovering this on my own, because that was a really cool, you know, discovery. Like, oh, I wonder... Because I get, I get the iron boots, and, of course, you start immediately you know, going around the lake and seeing if there's any treasures and secrets, which of course there isn't. But, and then I come in here and I'm like, oh my god, I can totally try the iron boots. And then I found the heart piece and it was okay. And excellent swimming, go. Okay. I'm gonna break it. How am I gonna break it? I don't know. Just the, only thing that the only thing that breaks the game is the weird <clears throat> fog. Yeah. Oh, I don't have bomb shoes. Otherwise, I could get into Jabu oh, no. as an adult. Well, too bad this isn't the 3DS version. We could just walk in there. It's like, what do you do? You, like, line up with a fence, backflip, jump twice to the no, side, it's like play a magic wrong. song, then, like, I'm just, 
It's the life grow dance. I know. Or... You like you like throw a you like lay a bomb chew at a certain angle and then follow it with the Z targeting and yeah, then it's weird. Oh there's another art base. You also I have to about adjust the camera angle. You have to wait for the camera to adjust itself or something. It's so dumb. It's life grow dance. And it's amazing to watch. Anybody needs to look up the uh Yeah, just King Jab like Lord Jabu Jabu is an as adult. An adult and it... So just mirrors the camera a lot closer to Link than it no, has in it right today. I, it's normally like that in this area. It's stupid. I don't like. The, I don't. I hate going across these things. <laughs> Ooh, that could have ended badly. God. Can we get into the damn cave? There we go. So what is the difference between a cave and a cavern? Is there Cavern's one? Cavern's bigger. Cave is like one room, cavern is probably like multiple rooms. Which makes sense for this game. Also, fuck these boulders. Yeah. Ah, keys. Yeah. So, so, since there's no blue fire in this place, it's quite simplified, yeah. which I'm fine with. Yeah, nobody really likes this place. I mean, it's kind of a cool place. They blend well into the surroundings. They really do. Um, so. The. When we first started going through this, we knew that we already had the like blue fire thing, right? Or did we do that later? No, we decided on that earlier. Yeah. I, ba I think we just basically wanted to. Okay, then. We wanted to make the uh, the rupee upgrade mandatory. That's true, so that's yeah. we're. I'm was trying to think of trying to think of any before. way that you could force the player to spend at least three hundred rupees. Yeah, I couldn't remember. And the only we thing we could think of was with the with the fire. Yeah. So. That was. Um, that was excellent. I think you passed the loading zone right when it showed up. Um, the issue with this, um, as anybody who has played the game knows, um, couch. Yay, that thing. That is a. That's a. That red ice sculpture is actually a beta object, I think. And for some reason, it's in Master Quest. And it does nothing, but it's a really cool sculpture. And for some reason, they took it out of regular E. Um, it's kind of an odd little thing that's there. I think it originally held hold something. I don't remember what else. I don't remember so you can those melt kind that. of switches ever making chests appear. It's kind of weird. So you can melt that, but nobody wants to melt that because it's awesome looking. Yeah, and you'd have to pay another 300 Yeah, that too. <laughs> now, did yeah, you... Man actually take the fire out of these rooms, or did you shove it under the ground? It's actually shoved underneath the ground, I believe. Yeah. Because oh. I forgot to take out the Navi text. <clears throat> it's actually shoved, like, really way below. Yeah, so you can't get it. So you can't get it. Because I had an issue... I think you can. Let's no, try. you can. If you can, then I fucked up. Yeah. <laughs> it's like There's shoved... probably, like, a single pixel where you can get it. I, I shoved it really way below. Alright. <clears throat> um, Should use the C up trick to the through the wall and see. I think it's just shoved downwards rather than over. But uh, it's uh. No way. What was it talking about? I'll find out. The ice couch. Yeah, the ice couch. Yeah. I don't remember now. Why do these things go invisible? Because <coughs> they're freezers. Just jump into the. Ice. The thing, yeah. The thing that I always remember about the freezers is my strategy guide at the end had a list of all the enemies in it, and um, they basically gave them a difficulty rating. And I remember that uh, it was it was a ranking out of five. Mm. And they used the same... Oh, I had a bottle. Oh, anyway, wow. um... Oh, he passed right here. They used the same ranking for bosses as for normal enemies. Great camera angle there. <laughs> um, and so I just remember both the Freezer and Phantom Ganon both getting a four. Yay. That's kind of awesome. I'm uh, not sure what that actually is. I don't did. know which way I came from. Let's see. <clears throat> Stupid boulders. But, um, the issue with this is anybody who's actually read the Read Me knows. Um, no way. Never make it. No way. <laughs> Loading zone. Yes. Did I just come from this direction? I believe you did, yeah. Because, like, it didn't look like I went this it's way on the map. It's hard to tell. Like, yeah. Did you go up before? Let's see. Compass, this so. is down. Okay, yeah, I want to go up the steps because it looks like a dead end, so. Yeah. I wanted to see what was that direction first. 
Sorry, I keep interrupting your train of thought. It's I don't even know what fine. you're saying. I'm, um, I think I'm trying to talk about Sheik, but I don't know if that's spoilers or not. <laughs> but, um, yeah, at the end, obviously, you knew when you played the game, Sheik shows up, teaches you Serenade of Water. Well, obviously, in the read me, I'm like, well, you don't learn Serenade of Water. The reason for this, as I'm sure we've talked about before, is that Sheik only shows up when you gather the actual iron boots in it's the game. so dumb. And it was... It's beautiful. Yes. And it was incredibly annoying to figure that out, or to find that out, because I was extremely confused when during testing, because I had... Come on. Um, I had put in the other item other than the iron boots, and she didn't show up, and I'm like, well... He should, so you can learn a certain water. <laughs> and she doesn't show up, and I'm like, well, why isn't he showing up? And I eventually, over testing and time and asking people, he just turns out he just doesn't show up because you don't because actually get reasons. the iron boots. Yeah, it's it's so dumb. Also, this bullshit switch. How do you hit it? You know, I shot it. It's finicky. Are we sure that that works? I believe so. I think you hit it. <clears throat> I don't remember how. Maybe arrows. What the hell is this? Let me try the hammer. Sometimes arrows work too, rather than bookshot. Oh, I think hammers. I didn't put that switch there, just saying. Interns, what did you do? I don't think I did. It might be an, like an arrow. There we go. Oh, okay. Ah, upskirt. upskirt. <laughs> God, I think that got rid of the the, uh, heart the white ice. Yeah. yeah, the white ice. It's it's healthier than homemade. Yes. <laughs> you should complain about the popsicles. I should complain about the popsicles because goddamn these popsicles. Yeah. So, <laughs> so random unrelated story time. <laughs> well, we are in the ice cavern. Yeah. I bought these popsicles from Walmart, right? For the record, these are uh, just so they're, it's not confusing. They're oh, basically those freeze pops. They're ice pops. Those little yeah. plastic tubes with a yeah, liquid in them that cheap. freeze. And, they're yeah, cheap. They're like, good, and they're good for like a quick snack if you're thirsty and hungry at the same time. It's just you grab one, you go. And they're like three bucks, three something like that, and you get like 20, 25 of them. So you get, I get them, I take them home, and I put them in the freezer. It takes like, um, I, they usually take maybe like a week to freeze completely if you don't take them out of the packaging, so I just leave them in there. Um, I take out some of the flavors that I like the best, like the grape, the pink, the, uh, you know, things like that. I never, well then. I don't know if you're screwed out of your kills then at that point. Because I don't know if they die. Um, I have a plan. Does that work? <laughs> wow. Okay, <laughs> that was kind of great. Um, this is the worst enemy in all of Hyrule, right here. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I thought it but, was. I thought the description was ah, case. Yeah. I think that might be the fire Probably. one. Um, but yeah, I uh, I bring the popsicles home, and I'm waiting for them to freeze for like a week, and they're lined up. Like I have my favorite flavors lined up, and only the green and the yellow I think are freezing. The red ones are too. Yeah, the red ones because I hate the red ones. I'm like, oh, I hate cherry. Anything cherry it reminds me of horrible cherry ice cream. Not ice cream. Um, cough medicine. Come I on, used you freaking to eat bat. As a kid, so I can't eat anything cherry nowadays. Um, so I'm watching these things not freeze, and I'm like, I'm gonna I, kill it with an ice cream. Am I going crazy? The irony of it. <laughs> so I'm asking people. I'm like, do you have a problem with popsicles not freezing in, in the uh, freezer? And they're like, well, are I your... will pull this off. <laughs> I'm like, well, are your is, is your freezer settings too low or something like that? And I'm like, the freezer have been have been at the same setting since we oh shit went into. Did well, they all respawn? <laughs> yeah, they do that. I think. Wait, am I back to the beginning? Yeah, maybe. Okay then. Okay then. Um, but they're just not freezing, and it has literally been probably a month and a half. It's been like two months at yeah, least. Yeah, and they have still not frozen. And the ice 
is not melting. There's nothing melting in the freezer that's been at the same setting since we rented the apartment. I have not changed anything, and for some reason, these popsicles will not freeze. And I was thinking of taking them back to Walmart and saying, they don't freeze. And then I would get really stupid have looks. Dysfunctional popsicles. <laughs> I have dysfunctional popsicles. Like, who who gets dysfunctional popsicles? We do. How do how do popsicles not freeze? Like, do they have antifreeze in them or something? Like, and only certain colors are freezing. It's just weird. And I just I don't know what to do. I mean, they're cheap enough to where I can just buy These a different. Freaking boulders. The boulders suck in this in this level. But yeah, they're cheap enough to where I could just buy another bag but it's just it's the principle of the matter that my popsicles didn't freeze and i want to know why so yeah that's the story of our not frozen popsicles i should probably put a camera in there and like prove to people that they, they don't freeze watch out there's a pit over there i know at least we know now that you can dump a bomb in the hole yeah i liked that that's so weird okay come on now you stupid bats you know you want to ruin everything do you have to get rid of them? I think you do. There's no pushing doing? puzzle in here. I think you have to kill them to make Can't this thing go down. Fine. Wait, what? Is there any reason to this, then? There's a sculptilla. Oh. Screw that, then. Okay, then. Sorry. I thought that there was a purpose to that room. Sorry. Not caverns easy. I love this room so much. Yeah, this room is rather cool. It's a shame the, like, the cutscene kind of doesn't happen. So... And then Sheik just shows up. That looked weird. So, have you figured out what this item is yet? Probably. I love it, the walls. Yeah, I don't get what, what's going on with these walls. Anyway, learn the truth. That's the truth. So help you see things. We might have actually mentioned before. this in a previous video when I went through the well, but anyway. Yeah. So Linda Truth is in here. In there. And that's why um, you don't get serenade of water. So. Yeah, because the game is just like, oh, iron boots aren't in here? Okay, well, no shit. Oh, screw that, yeah. There's you don't get to learn a song. Also, the chest icon doesn't disappear because the game doesn't know what's going on, apparently. Yeah, the game so, is really weird. That's about it for this place. Um, next time. Next time, I'll just kind of be at Lake Hylia, and we will go to everyone's favorite temple in the game. Favorite temple. Yes.